Hi friends, today I'm gonna show you how to create a latest news section on your Drupal site using the Drupal modules views, CCK and QuickTabs. Before we're gonna make this latest news, I just gonna show you how it looks like in a website. So this is a sample site I made for the vacuum and you can see here latest news section for three categories which is the vacuum news and the community news and the support news. So this is made using views, CCK and quick tabs and also at the right side you can see for the latest video same thing I used to create this and also I have created this view as a page for the, all the latest news here so this is what we are gonna make today so first thing we are gonna do is or as usual download all the modules from the Drupal site so first we download views then we download construction standard construction kit which is CCK and finally we download quick tabs after downloading all these modules upload it to your Drupal sites or modules directory and go to your Drupal site admin and enable all the modules let's go to the Drupal site I'm using localhost so I'm using MAMP in my Mac so I just go to my local site here Drupal and sign into my site after signing into your site go to your administrator and then modules enable all the modules I have already enabled all the modules in CCK all the modules and scroll down on views all views modules and finally quick tabs these are the modules we need to work uh, we need to create the latest news after enabling all these modules we have to create a new content type for the news so let's go to the administrator again and click on content type if you have installed and enabled CCK modules you can see these options for creating new content type so click on add content type and create a new content type for our latest news so I just give this as a latest news for the name it's a human readable name and the next one is machine readable name so give latest underscore news and then for the comment setting I don't want to get comments for my news so I just disable the comment and workflow settings just click only published do not promote to front page and then click save content type and now we have created our new content type called latest news the next thing we have to do is go to your administrator again then click on taxonomy we have to create a new taxonomy for each category such as um, something like uh, events or support news or whatever you want it's up to you you know whatever news you want to create so I just gonna create a vocabulary first so I just type it give it a name as latest news and then this news should be used for the content type latest news so I choose the content type as the latest news and I choose the field as required so the user must enter a value or select a value in order to create the news so we just make this as required and if you want to set the tags you can set it up and then click save now we have to add some terms because we don't have any terms if you check the list terms we haven't created any term yet so we click on add term and I create some terms so first we create events events this is for event news and another term we call support some support news and then last we create community some community related news community okay now we have created three, ter three terms and taxonomy and a content type the final thing we have to do is create the content so click on latest news and create news so first community news so this is a community news so we just choose community so we give some content for the community news community news 
I keep pasting that so we don't want to waste our time so then click save and we have created first news and then we create again one more news and this time we call it event news and then we choose events then some content events news save and we create one more content for support news then choose support from the taxonomy and we give some news support support news then save okay now we have created taxonomy we have created a content type and we have created our news the final thing we have to do is oh I always say final actually the next thing we have to do is creating a view so go to the views and click on add and now we call this name as latest underscore news give a machine readable name then human readable name um, latest news then tag you can give whatever you want latest news okay then on view type select node then click next and from here on default add fields first the thing we have to do is go to the add fields then click from group select node then we have to set the node title node title and node post date so since it's a news we need only the title and the post date the date the node is posted so first we just delete the label and then we can set the date format I just leave as it is then for the title we don't need the label and make sure you click on link this field to its node so that the title should be linked to its news the original node so click on update and now we have all the titles and um, dates so now we don't want all these titles and no dates to be displayed we need only the news type news content type so we just give a filter from node node type we click node type is one of latest news then update and also we give one more filter which is not published so we don't want some node which is not published so we want only published node to be exposed or displayed so we just select node published yes click update and the final thing we have to do is a style from style choose table then click update you can choose any style you want and if you want to sort by criteria like you know um, default sort I choose as an um, post date okay we want to sort the news by sorting the date and then you can see here override normal sorting if click sorting is used for example if you have sort if you are used by here you know the sort criteria from here it will override from here so if you how given a sort criteria here for example ascending and if you are given here descending only the one which is given for the table it will only that will work so don't confuse just just use descending and click update so that the latest post will be the top and finally we give one sort criteria here too by node post date add and descending of course then update then click save so we have created our basic view next we have to create some display first we create one display uh, block display and give this name as events so that it's a event news events click update and then for we have to filter one more thing because in events we don't want all the we want only the even news to be published so we just go to the taxonomy for filtering and taxonomy term ID make sure taxonomy term ID then click add then from this vocabulary we have three vocabularies here but our vocabulary is latest news so select latest news and then from select type choose drop down then show hierarchy 